It's New Year's Eve. A night where anything can happen. Anyone ever seen that movie New Year's Eve? With Lee Michelle and Ashton Kutcher? Because I have not. Maybe I should watch it today. And I always go all out for New Year's Eve. But this year, I've decided to go more all out. Because it's not only the end of the year, it's the end of the decade. And to me, that's horrifying. My childhood is over. I started this decade six and I'm ending at 16. That's scary. I started this decade in the first grade and now I'm looking at colleges. Going to my aunt's house, you know, for like the Fiesta Salsa Quinceanera Baila. I curled some of my hair. I took a shower though today. So this part of my hair is still wet. So I'm gonna give it a minute to dry while I do my makeup. And then when my makeup is done, should be done drying and then I can curl it. And then after I curl it, I can change into her. This is what I'm wearing for New Year's. So first I'm gonna take, I don't have any makeup on right now as you can tell by the fact that like your screen is breaking, but I'm not wearing any makeup right now. However, comma, I just wanna take off all like the oil or like even the dryness, like cause I get a lot of I'm very oily, but I get, I do get dry at the same time. I have very combination skin, so I don't have a lot of primer left. But I guess this is what we're getting, both in. I don't know where else to put your clothes. No room. Bye. Also, like, this green stuff, like, I don't know, like, let me try, like, blending it out. I don't even know anymore. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know who I am, if I'm honest with you. I'm just going for, like, it's the end of the decade, and I'm trying to make everyone who didn't date me in the decade depressed. You know what? That's pretty good coverage. This little guy here doesn't want to leave. He doesn't... Ooh, that's a lot. Parents call me the Paris Hilton makeup brush kit. I mean, it's not very good. Um, it's really good. No, I'm kidding. It's like kind of crap, but I'm kind of crap, so like that. It's not even a pimple. I'm feeling it. It's completely fat, flat, flat, flat. Mm. Uh, you know? Okay, that's like a lot, but like I respect it is what I'm saying. So this is a highlight brush from Fenty Beauty. I use it for blush, however. Um, don't ask me why. I just think it's a good blush brush, you know? Let's powder it up. I don't know why I said it like that. I'm trying to go like and like have the perfect cutout of the contour. Like it's just so ooh 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 ee. I'm gonna contour my eyes. And what I basically do is I just put like dark brown, like basically like my contour colors in the crease of my eye because then it makes my eyes look bigger and it makes it look like I did something which I, I did not. Okay, this one looks a little bit like garbage, but we're gonna like fix that right up. So now we're gonna do my eyebrows up. I don't have them, um, so I just like try, I guess, to like do something with them. Not how eyebrows work. So then I try to like fill it up so like the beginning looks fuller. But like here I am doing like the beginning steps right now. I genuinely like have trouble with this because like I feel like I'm talking to myself. We're just gonna brush this out, I guess. My nose is running. Why? So now, highlight. 
Nah. That's you. It's really not getting much. Like, make my nose cute and buttony like, even though it is big and witch like. So now we're gonna brush away this. My eyes already hurt. Is my hair like stop being wet? I think so. I don't like putting too, too much like color because I have big lips and like, I don't like bringing attention to my lips. I just want to like show that they're there. I'm probably just gonna curl it and then I'll see y'all after. This is the dress that I am wearing tonight. So this is what I'm wearing. This is the final look. Let's get more serious, okay? I assume everyone watching and I are the same generation and our decade of our childhood is over and that's really sad. I've had some good ass memories in this decade and I've had some good ass friends and I've had some good ass times and I'm not really prepared. Um, I don't know what will happen in the next decade. Um, I hope a lot of things for the next decade because by the end of the next decade I will be hopefully 26 and that's crazy. This decade treated me right and I hope it treated you right and if it didn't there's always next year there's always this next decade. My childhood's over we're like not gonna be kids anymore and like I like dress up and I put on makeup and I do my hair to be like, look, I'm not a kid anymore. I started this decade six and I'm ending it like this, but I still feel six. I still feel six. <laughs> oh, I forgot to put on perfume. I'm going to spray it like this. Thank you so much for watching. I have more videos coming out in the new year. Okay, I'm going to stop. Bye.